Oh my gosh, I don't feel so well. It seems... I don't know, I woke up with a huge pain in my back and I don't know why. Let me, let me check. Maybe I should check what draws my back. Oh my god, I have a freaking tail! Oh dear god. Um... Uh, in all seriousness, guys, this is a mod review for the Tails mod. Uh, the owner, uh, I guess, uh, she's the original author, but she brought in some help. Uh, her name is Kitsune Kahira. I think that's how you pronounce it. Um, she made, oh, no, wrong button. Wrong uh, button, okay. She made the, uh, she made this, the, uh, Tails mod. Uh, let's get into detail with that. So, uh, you press your inventory button, and then down here is the Tails editor. Um, uh, let's do this to show it off a bit from the side, if I can get to 90. Nope. area. Okay, so you have your tails, your fox tail, your twin tails, and nine tails, because it could be nine ta nine tails from uh, from Pokemon, because that's awesome. Uh, you got the lizard tail, which is no different from the dragon tail, except for the dragon has the uh, the spine thing is I don't know what they are. You got the uh rat the raccoon tail, the devil tail with the tip right there. I don't know if you can see my mouth, but there's the devil tail with the tip and then there's a devil tail with no tip, which kinda looks like a monkey tail, but it still looks awesome. So I like the dragon tail, so I'm gonna go with that. Over here you have the uh that's a decimal where you can go into the different colors. Uh, I think I think this is uh, different for everyone, the way it starts out. Mine started out black for me. I don't know if it will start up the same for you, but you can go into here and edit the colors. You have the hexadecimal colors that you can do. Uh, there's the... Um, the sliders for the different colors, I'm not going to go into that because I like, I like my tail how it is. Uh, each, uh, each of the different tints makes the tail look more uh, shaded, I guess you could say. Uh, what I've done with uh, saving the colors, uh, changing the colors, hit save. And then, uh, hit done right here. But I want to show you the, uh, export, uh, you can export the tail onto, onto your skin. And it will show what your skin looks like as, uh, with the tail. Uh, from what the mod author said, you can, uh, I just hit done right there. But you can uh, play this completely on servers. Like, it doesn't do anything other than show you have a tail on the client side. So there's no actual modification of the server needed. So you can go onto a random server like I shall be doing in a couple uh, couple seconds after I'm done talking. Uh, and I will show you guys the uh, the tail on a server. So I will show you guys that, and I'll be right back. I got well, I right, guys. So here we are on the uh, Mindplex server, and tail. I still have it. Unfortunately, it doesn't show anyone else's tails. That'd be awesome. Uh, yeah. I think, um, 
I think if I export it, other people will see it too. Because this is completely client side. And it overrides the skin on the client more than on the server. So, yeah. I have a tail. Well, I forgot about that. <laughs> okay. So, I will see you guys in the uh, next module view if I ever do one. But, I hope you guys enjoyed the mod. Uh, I'll put a link in the... I'll put a link to the description, or the, a link to the mod in the description for you guys, and hope you guys will download it. The mod is awesome, and I'll see you guys next time.